Hello, everyone. Welcome to Low Impact Cardio Workout with Robin. 30 minutes of your time. Timer's already going. You know the drill. If you've done other videos, start moving with me. We'll get warmed up. I'll talk you through what we're going to do. Low impact cardio means we're probably always going to keep at least one foot on the ground. We're not going to be too jumpy, heels up front, or too bouncy. But we're going to keep going. We're going to keep, we're going to make the most of this 30 minutes. Your heart rate's going to be high. You can get that cardio sweat without hurting your joints, hurting anything, or like just pooching out if you're just getting started with cardio. Now that's not to say, let's open our hips, that if you do want to increase this to higher impact cardio, you can't. All these moves can be bouncy, but with you and me, let's just take it. Oh, hips go in. Excellent. So today, we have six moves for our low impact cardio. That's marching in out. We're going to do them back to back to back because it's cardio. I only have you for a short period of time. Let's make the most. Let's do step back, step. We'll switch legs in a second. Round one, 60 seconds a piece. Switch legs. Round two, 45 seconds a piece. Switch. Round three and four, switch, are 30 seconds, and they're back to back, step touch. Did we get that? 60 seconds, 45, 30, 30, okay? We'll rest in between before the time change, but uh, otherwise that's the formula for today. We start with lots of time, doing a movement, get used to it, decrease, and that's uh, really good. We will finish, heels up front. We'll finish the workout with some core. Okay, just on the floor, three movements. We'll get to that later. Keeping it simple though. Let's do squat and scoop. Toe, toe. We've got good music in store for us. And I think it's just gonna be a really great workout. No equipment needed, you see nothing around me. It's for grabs, low impact, body weight. In and out, in and out, and in. Pump those arms. Let's roll the shoulders back. Promote good posture. One at a time. Getting jiggy with it. No, 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 no. Other way, forward. And back. Move number one is gonna be butt kicks. It's coming up real soon in 10 seconds. We're here. Okay, for a minute. I'll give us some different alternatives to make the minute go by faster, okay? Workout has started, butt kicks. Push and pull the air. Heel the bum. Yes. You can go with the music or we can go slow it down. Choose your pace. Excellent. Now. We can travel with it. You can come walk closer to me. Walk back. Go in a diagonal. So we'll travel with this, okay? You're high impact. You're going a little more icy, fast through the balls of your feet. A low impact, one foot, it's always on the ground. Good, 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 good. Stay with it. 10 seconds. This is the flavor that we're gonna bring to all of your music lovers. Are you ready to come along? Make it up, follow me. Three, two. We're gonna shuffle side to side. Let's go this way. Shuffle. Light on our feet. And shuffle back. Side what feels good for you. We can pick up the speed. Fast feet. Soccer drills. Stay light on your feet. We can turn it into a squat walk. Otherwise, little skip to my loo for the whole minute. To spice this up, see if you like it, we'll cross, reach, aim for your toes, okay? Perimeters of your room, sink down through the knee, don't curl your back. You with me so far? 
Next move will be a high knee in 10 seconds. Three, two, one. Face me, knee. Low impact, nice march. Knees up to the ceiling, as high as you can. We're not here. If that's as high as you can go, that's fine. But if you can go a bit higher, do it. To add some zest to this, take it wide. Super not ladylike. And go in, in, out, out, okay? Keeping the hips really mobile. Keep that march going. High impact, high knee. You're here, okay? Still driving the knees up. I just know a minute is a long time to be doing that. Next move, we'll starfish. Reach for our toes, reach overhead. This is my starfish stance. Straight legs, I'm gonna reach down, reach down, overhead, over, again. Okay, that up and down motion, and back up, keeps our heart rate the same, really high, okay? Keeps the cardio reach. Making this a full body experience. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, right? 30 seconds. Core is tight. Keep that engaged as you reach, as you pull down, okay? You're doing great. Move number five, mountain climb. We'll be down on the floor. If you need an elevation, grab a chair, grab a bench. Otherwise, we're on the floor. A minute will be a long time. We'll take it slow. Down into a plank. Like so, where butt's not high, knees to chest. Check how straight my arms are. And I'm not leaning. Don't do this. Forward, where you can feel all the good muscles doing their work. Now if you want to spice it up and go faster, you can. If you're doing it off the bench, I'm over here now. It's a little less strenuous on your wrist if you need that. Otherwise, we're halfway. Keep it going. Check that my mic back, I'm not punching it off. We're still good. I know you can still hear me. Keep mountain climbing. Move number six will be a body weight thruster. That's a squat to overhead press. No weights. Five seconds, core is juicy. Roll up. I have 10 weights, hip width apart with your feet, squat to press. Okay, we're sinking through the knees, straight spine, press. Everything is active, everything is like muscle ready. Be conscious of your whole body. This is my least favorite exercise probably of all time, I don't know why. So practicing it with body weight will help me feel more confident, help me challenge myself when I add it into other exercises or other workouts with weights in hand. Keep it going. 10 seconds and then we rest. Through the heels. One more. 45 second rest, okay? We never do them for a minute again. Rocking, round one done. Now have a little small sippy sip of water. You know how it is. Round two, 45 seconds a piece. Same movement. We'll start with those butt kicks on the ground. Shuffle, high knees, so on and so forth. It's not a breath. Hope this is low for you. It's already, it's low because Keeping the one foot on the ground. I'm already rambling, I'm losing my words. But it's effective low cardio. When we're breathy, we're sweaty, and we just feel good about it. Butt kicks. 
Down two, 45 seconds this entire round. I love workouts that don't take too much space, either at home or the gym or wherever you're doing it. You know how you see some people that are going from one end of the gym to the other, the squat rack, you know, the curl, preacher curl, to the bench, all over. You know, most of us don't have that much space to work with. I just want my little space, minimum equipment, use what I have, get in, get out, move on, but feel really good. We're going to our shuffle. Let's do it, switch it out. Choose your speed, don't trip. Check out your surroundings. Top of the head, always up to the ceiling. If you're in an apartment and you have neighbors below, we're really nimble, we're not stomping to wake them up or disturb them. We're doing good. I kind of turned it into a step and lunge. You have that option too. Almost there. We're going to high knees next. Face me. March. We can take it wide and in. Starting to break a sweat. Really breathy. That back to back is what's keeping us high energy. Halfway. You might get tired and just move. If you can just move, great. Be conscious of each rep. Do your best to drive the knee up. We have our starfish toe touch reach up next. Wide stance, starfish out cross reach. My legs are straight. I feel the pull behind my legs, hamstrings. I'm resisting gravity with my arms. Oh, I'm not doing the overhead. <laughs> Working the core with the overhead reach. Full body experience. Almost there. We'll go down to the floor. Mountain climb. Choose your speed. Shorter than the last time. It's only 40, 45 seconds. We can do it. We can go to Miley Cyrus's voice. Good, keeps us focused. Everything feels strong. My arms, shoulders, core, my quads and bum, and my heart rate. I say this every time, but full body experience is excellent. All right, up to our feet. Body weight thrusters. Square it up. Squat, press. Sit down, stand up. something off the shelf, you're bringing it back down, up and down. Halfway. How we doing? Feeling good so far? We're moving right along. We will rest in five. Four. All right. Purple is rest. <laughs> Purple's the good color in this room. <laughs> oh, goodness. Take a drink of water. Collect yourself. I'm still on. I'm still on. All right. Now we're going down to 30 seconds, so it's shorter. So we'll fire through it but we're doing it back to back. Okay, we're going one through six, one through six, no rest. 
that's the challenge. Okay? You can do it. Butt kicks to start in 10 seconds. One to six, one to six. And then we'll have a nice break and prepare for core. Okay? Butt kicks, let's go. Get those arms moving. Push and pull the air. Travel with the knees. 10 seconds. Three, two, one. Shuffle. You can also zigzag. Do a little X in your room. Challenge your brain to change directions, right? Keep it going. 10 seconds. I'm just all over the place here. Three, two, one. High knee, face knee. Knees up. Pump it. Let's consider this our active recovery from the shuffle, right? We're kind of resting. We're still moving. All good. Wide and in. Toe touch is next. Let's just do toe touch, okay? No overhead, we'll do that next. Next round. Just reach and touch up and down. Whew, still effective. Still breathy. Keep those arms good and straight. Down to the floor, mountain climb. Don't waste any time. Knees in, check your bum, can you clench it? If not, lean forward, get that butt down. Wonderful, 10 seconds. Three, two, roll up. Thrusters, watch yourself. And up. We're keeping it slow and controlled too. We're not racing. Do you have any kind of vertical, vertigo or dizziness? Don't want that. I just want you to be able to move your body for 30 minutes. Back to butt kicks. After this, remember, no rest. Switch it. Still friends? We're still friends. We're doing well. Move around your room. Let the interval go by fast. Heel the bum. Ready to shuffle. Let's go. Super light on your feet. You're doing so good. It's our last round of cardio. Ten seconds. Three. High knees. Pump it up. Not too bad, huh? Three more rounds to go. Then we take it nice and slow. In and out. We're gonna go overhead reach, starfish, up, and up. Kind of like a dancer warm up. Long arms, long legs, great reach. Ten.
10 seconds. Down to the floor. Climb. Climb for the last time. Today. Keep it up. Halfway. Stay strong. Straighten out. Three, two, up, 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 up. Thrusters. <laughs> Woohoo. <laughs> through the heels. So sink through the knee. Drive up through the heels. Yes. Halfway. Keep at it, almost done. One more. Great. This is how long we're resting before core. You did the cardio. Now we're just gonna have a little, a little sit. Pull up the pants a little bit. <laughs> down we go. Okay. Three moves only three rounds, 30 seconds each back to back. So we're used to that timing. If you can manage this position, feet together, feet down, and then we lie down. So the aim of the knees towards the floor. Either hands behind your ears or hands overhead in a triangle, and we'll crunch. The frog crunch, okay? If it's not good on your leg. We'll do standard, but I challenge you to get some hip mobility in there, okay? We warmed up our hips with those knees. Might as well use them. Move number two, we'll go in a plank. Either hold the plank or then go hip dip. Move number three, on our forearms, scissor. So we have flutter kicks. We're not doing those. Cross, straight legs, flex your feet, scissors. Frog to start in that many seconds, eight, seven. Let's set it up. No chin to chest, okay? Small lift through your core and release. Don't strain your neck. No tension there. Push your center and release. It's almost like a staple in your core and then loose. Staple. Almost done. Flip over into your plank. High, low, toes or knees. Here's a high plank. Hip side to side. We can do that on our forearms as well. Or on our knees. Butt is low. Remember, clench those cheeks. Just hip bone. Action. Cross core. Workout. 10 seconds. Looks good. Breathe still. Three, two, one. Scissor kicks. We're on our forearms. Yeah, no strenuous, no strenuous. Your neck isn't being strained. Can't talk. Scissor. Check me out. Ooh, it's starting to burn. We'll rest soon. Ten seconds. Ready, ready, four, three, two, release. Okay, that's our rest. Round one done. We're gonna do it two more times. Okay, now step back. Frog crunch to start. That triangle I'm doing with my hands, just a reach to kind of reach for the ceiling and release. Give it some target. Or sometimes where our hands are kind of ears, we use it to lift our neck. Not good. Decide what's comfortable for you. Set it up. Ready? Here we go. I'm trying to face away because this isn't the most ladylike position. Reach for the ceiling and release. Draw up from your core. 
and then let the core release you down to the ground, okay? 10 seconds. Flip over your plank hip dips. I'll show you this way this time so you can see my butt is low. You can barely see my hip dips. That's a good sign. Whew. Excellent. 10 seconds. Loosen my mic. We're on to our uh, scissor kicks. Forearms. I've lost six seconds. Gotta make up for it. Choose your speed. We can go fast. We can slow it down. Both are challenging. Keep at it. 10 seconds. Five, four. Release. Oh my goodness. <laughs> All right, wonderful, good job. One more time to go. Do I have a surprise? Yes, I do. I was gonna wait and spill the beans at the end. Bonus move after our last scissor kicks, okay? So don't be all getting up, stay down. We'll have one bonus move. Frog crunch though, final round. Set it up, lie down. Go to work. Is our core feeling hot and spicy? Yes. <laughs> Keep at it. And time over to our plank. Dips. Last time doing this one. Thank you. 